Hello there, I'm Professor Aguilar and I wish to welcome you to GIST 11, a course where I will be leading you through a journey of discovery of the world of maps. As a geographer, I love maps. Uh, right behind me here is one of my favorites. This is a map of Central America with uh, Honduras right in the middle, which is where I'm from. The main map is a what we call a reference map so one that shows roads rivers mountains towns this is the kind of map that you use to get your bearings to get to know uh, a place and how to get from one location to another you will also see this map has three smaller inset maps uh, which are not reference maps the first map here is a land use map this is what we call a qualitative thematic map, uh, where each color represents a different type of land use. Right below that is another qualitative thematic map. This one is ethnic distribution, where each color represents a different ethnic group. And here at the bottom, we have a population density map. This is what we call a quantitative thematic map because the symbols here represent actual quantities or numbers. So the bigger the circle, the larger the population. So this is meant to just give you a taste of the kind of things that we're going to be doing in class. Uh, we're going to be learning about uh, maps, how to make maps. Uh, you'll be making your own maps. We'll be using your skills and creativity uh, to create appealing and effective maps. We'll be using really cool software online, uh, software called RGIS Online, uh, that uh, will give you access to lots of data. We'll be playing with data to create our own, our own maps and, and to interpret and analyze existing maps. Uh, so I hope you enjoy the class. I think it'll be uh, a very um, entertaining, enjoyable class. If you need help with anything, please uh, don't hesitate to reach out to me. I'm here to help you succeed.